Okay, Frank, y'all know it's been a tough week for our girl, Wendy Williams, and it looks like right about now she's a hot topic, okay? Mm. So just one week after her shocking television announcement of living in a sobriety house and struggling with addiction, Wendy allegedly fell off the road to recovery, y'all. Oh, wow. that's unfortunate. Yeah, unfortunately, it's been reported that the talk show host was found drunk after checking out of the sober living facility Monday, and she was rushed to ER for recovery. Oh, that's oh, drunk. Oh, you wow. go to the hospital? That's not yeah. drunk drunk. That's no, it wasn't that something. drunk drunk. She showed up for work. Oh. Yeah, because no, she, she got drain drained. Yeah, she got her little vitamins. <laughs> you she, said drain She drain. got drain drained. <laughs> she got drunk <laughs> drunk. <laughs> Detox time. Right. Drip drip. <laughs> 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 Let that girl get her check, honey. But here's the thing. You know she watches Dish Nation. You know she's watching us talk about her being in the sobriety house, and she's been honest about it on her show. So why so soon to admitting all that stuff do you fall off the wagon? It seems like that would almost uh, empower you Keep to you stay, stay on, though. Okay, let me give you the facts. Well, the streets oh. are talking, and rumor has it that her husband's alleged longtime mistress, Sharina Hudson, who's been shown on Daily Mail TV, gave birth Sunday evening. What? And that prompted Wendy into a downward spiral. That would make oh, you yeah. want to have a cocktail. Wendy has made it very clear, like, she will run any business of anyone else's all day long. That's but true. she does not want her business dealt with. And she like, shouldn't she have just her does business not. dealt with. She should. Y'all know that Wendy's a gossip report, honey. That's what she does. Right. So if you can dish it, you better be able to take it. But here's the thing. It's like I know on her show, like she'll turn to the audience and they'll ask her advice questions and she'll, uh, you know, give them advice. So don't you lose credibility if you can't even give yourself advice when you're giving everybody else advice? Mm. Well, well, no, well, this depends is on the advice she's giving. They'll be like finding not... Tony Robbins all f somewhere. <laughs> <laughs> it's like when uh, in the in the Catholic religion they force you to go to uh, a priest for couples counseling before you get married. I'm like, now how in the hell is a priest gonna tell me how I'm supposed to be living with somebody day in and day out? Like right. never you haven't done even it. done it. Exactly. You haven't even had yeah. sex. You've had sex with more women than he has. <laughs> <laughs>